Hello guys, this video will guide you step by step and show you how to play Xbox Game Pass, Epic Game and Codex Game on your Steam Deck. First, please make sure your Steam Deck has Windows 10 or 11 already installed. Also, all the Windows drivers should be installed too. If you like to install Windows on your Steam Deck, please click this video. It will guide you step by step to install a free legal copy of Windows on your Steam Deck. Before we start this tutorial, I would like to demonstrate the issue that we have on the Steam Deck if we have not completed this guide. If you already have Windows installed on your Steam Deck, the joystick and XYAB buttons are not working at this point. We can go to Windows USB Game Controller and find that Windows does not recognize any Steam Deck built-in joystick and buttons at this point. I will try to run a no Steam game. This is a Codex game right now. We can see the game cannot detect any Steam Deck building controller. So we are not able to play this game on Steam Deck right now. Now let's begin our tutorial. First, make sure you have Steam installed on your Steam Deck. I will just speed up this whole installation process. After Steam is installed, just go ahead and log in your Steam account. Now we are inside of Steam. First, go to Steam, Setting, click in Game, and make sure you check the second row. Use the big picture overlay when using Steam input enabled controller. Next, under Controller, go click General Controller Settings. Then make sure check Xbox Configuration Support. That's all we need to do inside of Steam. We can minimize the Steam window for now. Now let's move to step 2. In step 2, we need to install glosses, which will allow Windows to recognize Steam Deck built-in controller as an Xbox 360 controller. The glosses download link is available under my video description. Download the glosses from the website and extract all. Then go inside of the Glosses folder and double click VIGEMBUS Setup and install it. Next, double click VCREDIST and install it. Then scroll up and find HID, HIDE, MSI and install it. That's all we need to install. Now step 3, configure glosses. Still inside a glosses folder and find the glosses configure.exe file. Run the glosses config.exe as administrator. Make sure you run this as administrator, otherwise it wouldn't work. Now click the plus button on the right bottom corner. Under the shortcut type, select add manually. On this page, you can type any name you prefer. I will just type Steam Deck Controller. Then just uncheck the first box and leave the rest like mine. Now we can click down. On this page, we only need to click the button that has a Steam icon with a plus sign next to it. So it tells us to restart Steam to reload our changes. All you need to do now is close your Steam and restart it again. After the Steam is restarted, go to the library. You will see that the Steam Deck controller that I created inside of Glosses is show up under the Steam library. Now you just need to click the play button and wait for a few seconds. You should hear a USB connection sound like this. This means that the Steam Deck built-in controller now is recognized as an Xbox 360 controller by Windows. Now let's go to USB game controllers. 
we can see the Windows treat the Steam Deck built-in controller as Xbox 360 controller now. This means we can now run any games with the built-in controller on Steam Deck. I will run this Codex game again and see how it works now. We can now play this game with Steam Deck built-in controller. The game reads the Steam Deck controller perfectly now. Let's start the game and have fun for a few seconds. Once you have finished this guide on your Steam Deck, if you want to play any no Steam game, just go to the Steam library and play this file that was created from Glossies, which will allow you to use Steam Deck built-in controller to play any games on Steam Deck. I hope this video helped you out. If you have any questions, please leave a comment below. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching. Have a good day.